Hey guys, welcome back to Yokai Watch Wibble Wobble, and today I'm going to be doing something a little bit special, and that is some more fusions. But before I do that, if you're watching this video around the time when it comes out, there are some really awesome events going on right now on Wibble Wobble and in real life. The first of which is that if you go to GameStop anywhere in North America and you buy some crud, oh, look at all that cool merchandise, you can actually get a free medal. And yeah, it's kind of weird that they're advertising it as a free medal you have to pay for but yeah I'm gonna probably try and get that today or so and show it to you guys maybe at a later date but not the most exciting thing for those who play wibble wobble since it doesn't really have a, that much to do with the game more exciting is the fact that now s ranks are twice as likely to appear with 3,000 money why money yeah it's pretty darn cool. So today I'm going to be doing that probably at the end of the episode, but that's not what the episode is titled. What the title of this video is, is the fact that we're going to be doing a lot of fusing. So, I've been playing Wibble Wobble for a while, and these items down here, oh boy, they took me a lot, a lot of grinding. Not really the Glacial Clip, because you just get that if you buy a little bit of wine money. But uh, yeah, I'm going to be doing some fusion in this episode, because I really want to get... Where is he? Tim and Devil? Yeah. His next form, which uh, will we fuse with the um, Shard of Evil, is going to be, as I found out, one of the best yokai in the game. And he's going to be really helpful to unlocking infinite Y money. Now, I'm going to be talking about that a little bit later, but for the time being, we should go in order. So, first up, we got the Beetler, so let's drag him into the fusion box and then take the General Soul to create a new yokai. And unfortunately, yeah. I kind of need to, well, spend some wine money to do all this, but here we go! Oh! And you can probably already know who this yokai is if you've played before. Yes, it's Beetle! Not bad. Not a bad S rank yokai. Now I have almost all of the, well, yokai of the Brave Tribe, and I'm pretty pumped about that. But next up is Signable, who's really not super exciting. I got the GHZ orb pretty recently through the Goldie Bones events. Not really anything too exciting about that necessarily, but hey, if you don't got Static King from the Krankakai machine, you can get him this way too, even though that orb is really, really tough to grab, and yeah, I already had him a couple times, but moving on to a yokai that I'm very excited to talk about. That's right, it's Frostina. I actually have two Glacial Clips, so I could get two of these yokai if I so desired, and yes, yes, gosh, everything costs so much Y money in this game. If only there was a way I could get infinite Y money without having to pay real life money. <gasps> is that what John's working on next? Yes, it is. Anyways, Blizzaria, she's fantastic. One of the coolest charming yokai in my mind. Gosh, she's just so cool, but sadly, she's kind of hard to level up. Next up is Grumples, who, well, if you know anything about me, you really like this yokai because, well, she is really, really strong. But let's get rid of all that old, saggy skin. And gosh, that item took... This item, the Ageless Powder, took me so long to get, guys. You have literally no idea. My gosh, but it's worth it because Ever 4 is the bay. Not really, because she's still kind of old and stuff. And with that, I have literally every single... Eerie Tribe Yokai, which is actually pretty exciting, but moving on next to Timid Devil, who I'm really excited for, and we're going to combine the Shard of Evil to create a Yokai that almost has no weakness. Because really, his Soul Summit just buffs other Yokai. Yeah. This is Beelzebold, who is one of my favorite Yokai just because, well, it's pretty. I don't know. He's just kind of. It's kind of crazy that even exists in a children's video game, but whatever. And last but not least, not a item fusion by any means, but we're going to combine Watcha Got and Papa Windbag to create one of the most interestingly designed yokai I think I've ever seen. This one is pretty different, <laughs> to say the least, but his name is Pride Shrimp. Yeah, if you ever watched Fighting Foodons as a little, little kid, this guy might kind of look like one of the characters of that show. And that's all the fusing that we're going to be doing in this episode. I gotta say though, now that I have completed that, I can go to my mission log and yes, awesome. So we got 3k Y money. Not bad, so I'll get me another shot of the Cranky Kai machine. And also, hey, 
We got an EXP orb. Not bad. And ooh, a few seven yoka. Oh, we got that one too. Wow, I'm getting a ton of EXP. Awesome. Gonna use that hopefully on some new yokai coming out. But yeah. Outside of that though. Oh wait. How close am I? Oh wow, I actually finished that. Okay, so now we got two tries at the Krankakai machine, which is gonna be pretty darn exciting. There is a high chance we can get some S rank yokai. Now currently, and I'm just gonna go to my medallion real quick, I am still looking after two S rank yokai I still really need. We got all the Gilgaros, and I'm leveling up Gilgaros right now, but I still need to befriend Papillion and also Swell Terrier to get all the legendary yokai. I really, really need Swell Terrier, so if I get him in this episode, you guys are gonna probably hear man being very loud. But anyways, I got some, I have one level five coin from the Goldie Bones event, and also two shots at the Krankakai with the Y money. We got pretty good shots at getting an S rank now. Hopefully I get one and not a snake. Yeah, okay, okay, come on, come on, Swell Terrier, Swell Terrier, Swell Terrier. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That's awesome. <laughs> Okay, not Swell Terrier, but I got Venoct, and I'm cool with that, dude. You rescue me, perhaps I should acknowledge your ability. Ooh! Okay, so now I have Shadow Venoct and Venoct, and debatably in this game, Venoct is stronger than Shadow Venoct. Okay, that's fine. I don't care what else I get in the rest of them. Uh, it's not Swell Terrier, but it'll do. We got a blue. That's totally cool. Anything would be great right about you know what no not not that I don't want any more snakes and I actually found out recently um once you max out the ultimates of a Krankakai exclusive yokai such as Coppolet which we just saw he'll stop appearing so eventually if I max out Coppolet he'll literally stop showing up but yeah let's um insert I got some I got some coins here and I actually found out very recently also that you can get a ro not a Rochi Venot with a one star coin and what are we getting here oh not not venox we don't take that so i thought it was going to be something better than well tub of, tub of dude but it wasn't okay last but not least we got a level five coin and i keep calling you that instinctively if i get swell terrier i would have the last yokai i need to do my farming tactic which would be really really exciting can I get him now? I don't know. I'm gonna try it. So cross your fingers, guys. I really, really need Swole Terrier. There's a decent shot. I can get an S-rank Yokai with this five-star coin. So can't believe I got a Rochi though. <laughs> and there's also a lot of really bad Yokai with the five-star coin, but let's give it a shot. Come on, Swole Terrier. Please, please, please. It's red. That's not good. Come on, something good, something good, something go. God dang it. Thank you for, yeah, yeah, cool. And unfortunately, because I fused, yeah, that yokai, Beetler's rank got bet, set, set back down to one for his ultimate. So we're probably gonna see a lot more Beetles if I keep playing the Krankakai machine. But hey, we got a Rochi though, and I'm totally fine with that. Let's check out the Wibwabs we got. Um, Really, it was pretty much the Orochi show, or <laughs> not a I gotta stop calling him the Venoct show. There's Venoct though. Pretty darn cool. I'm happy to have him. His Octo Snake attack is decently strong, and well, he's elite yokai who fights with Dragon Scarf. Pretty darn cool. That's all the time I have for today, guys. I know I have not been making a lot of Wibble Wobble videos, but I realized very quickly that if you guys just see all the main stages with my same team, that's gonna get really boring really quickly. So I'm trying to raise up other teams so I can finish up the main story and have a variety of different yokai to show you in battle. But yeah, definitely if you have some Y money saved up, which you should if you've done the Goldie Bone event, make sure to use it this week because there's a really high chance you're gonna get S rank yokai or better yet, holy EXP orbs or soul secret books. Keep that in mind. So if you're playing a lot of yokai watch, Definitely, definitely consider grinding this week just to get some of those really rare yokai from the Cranky Guy Machine. Anywho, that's all the time I have today. Like I said, hope you guys have a great one. Good luck out there. Hopefully, you pull some awesome yokai. Man, see you in the next video. Bye.